What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. For those that are new here, hi, my name is Rochelle and I like to make thrifting and fashion videos along with a little bit of beauty and just sharing my life with you guys over here on my little corner of the internet. For today's video, I'm doing a very exciting Shein haul. I have not ordered anything from Shein in so long. I took a really long break. I like to thrift most of my clothes and feel really good about shopping secondhand. But every once in a while when I'm shopping and thrifting, I can't find specific things that I'm looking for that I really wanted for summer. Hence why I made this Shein order. I was looking specifically for a certain style of sandals and I couldn't find them online. I could find them on Amazon but they were like four times the price so I broke down and made a Shein summer haul which I'm very excited about because there were some other really cute things that I wanted to share with you guys as well. Perfect for summer. This is very like beachy, sunshine, colorful vibes. Lots of shoes, lots of accessories, lots of bikinis. I picked up these beautiful orange shiny chunky slides sandals mules mules they look like this right here i think that they're beautiful they kind of remind me of patent leather so they are kind of like shiny but very easy to walk in with this really chunky heel and they're not overly tall so very easy just to wear you know i i'd even wear these to like the grocery store or just running errands i think that they're so cute and i've been loving the bright colored accessories like bags shoes sunglasses. I decided to pick these ones up because I don't have any orange shoes and I have quite a few tops and just like cute things that I want to pair with orange shoes for a little pop of color. This is a style of shoe that I've talked about in the past. I've searched for on my vacations when I was in Las Vegas and Los Angeles and I found one pair but I really wanted bright colors and it is this really cute little sandal right here. I love the like slide style of the sandal that you just slip your little foot in right like that and then it has a bit of a fun like braided texture on the top there. I specifically love them as well when they have the square toe. I just really like the square toe and I think it looks really cute with nicely manicured toes. I wear a ton of flip-flops in the summertime, but I feel like this is just a little bit more of like an elevated sandal that looks nice when going out to dinner or going shopping, something that's just a little bit more fancy while still being very casual and flat. Um, here is a cute little pink pair right here. Same kind of style with the square toe and the braiding. These ones are interesting though. On the top of the material, they're almost a little bit like shiny or something. They have a bit of like a sheen on the top of the pink on these ones, but I just think that they're so cute. And then the last color I ended up getting is this really beautiful like baby lavender purpley color right here. Exact same shoe in purple and I just think that they're so pretty and cute. Honestly, now I kind of want them in blue and green. Like I just want every, I want every color. So if you guys are looking for this style of slide sandal, they're much more affordable on Shein than even on Amazon. Like on Amazon, I think that these were like 55 to 60, most of them. So I think these were around the $20 mark. And this is the last pair of shoes. And these are ridiculous. I like them, but I have some issues. They are these shoes right here. And these are a dupe for a designer pair of shoes. I'm forgetting the name of the designer pair, but I will pop up the picture right here with the price tags, like very expensive, crazy chunky mules. And then they have this very fun, like hourglass shaped heel. I don't know where I'd ever wear these. Like maybe I might go out and wear something like this, but the problem with these shoes specifically, the arch is obviously very steep, even though they do have quite a bit of a platform. Like it is a very high shoe. So it is hard to walk in. And I will say too, they had this pair and they had a pair with a crisscrossing around the ankle to secure it to your ankle. And I ended up going with this pair and I regret it because they don't really stay easily on your ankle. I don't know. I might just display these because they are rather hard to um, wear. I might practice a little bit and if not, they're gonna be decor. I still think they're cute, but get the ones that have the strap. Next up, I will do the bags. I ended up getting three different bags. This one right here is probably my favorite of the three and it is just really like very simple, easy, kind of like a pea green little purse. Like the color, just kind of like an avocado green or like a split pea soup kind of green. Very simple, easy. I like that it has a long strap because I'm a crossbody girl. So I feel like this will just be great to wear crossbody 
with a bunch of colorful other accessories and I like this one a lot. On the other hand though, this one, I don't know if I recommend it. I like the style that it was going for and the overall look of it. It's pretty cute. Like from over here, don't look close up. It's pretty cute. It's one of those um, like dumpling bags or baguette bags, kind of like the Bottega Veneta style. And I love that it's orange. It'll match the shoes. I think it's very cute. But this one is constructed kind of cheap, you know? Like I would do this for Instagram photos, but I wouldn't use this as like my everyday purse, you know what I'm saying? Um, it's just kind of, I don't know. And then they did give me this, okay? But it's not attached and it's not, it has no ties, it has no buckles. Like am I just supposed to rope it on to the sides and like tie it in a knot? But then like what if I wanna take it off? I can't take it off, I have to like, you know what I'm saying? Just kind of not constructed well. They should have given you like a clip, you know, to clip it onto here. Yeah, I probably will use this, but I wouldn't recommend purchasing it to be honest with you guys. That's a no for me, dog. And then moving on to the last little bag, it is this one right here. It's just kind of like a square tote type bag. It's like these leaves and it kind of has a bit of a sheen to the fabric, which is pretty. This one also isn't construction, constructed like the greatest, but it also isn't like terrible. I just, it kind of looks like an affordable bag. You know what I'm saying? Definitely put tons of stuff in there, maybe for like a beach day or something. I could even use it for storage. Like maybe if I wanted to put all my like scarves or, you know, something in here just for storage. Moving on to bathing suits. I do really like a lot of my bathing suits that I've gotten from the past um, from Shein. So I was excited to get some colorful bathing suits as well. Tis the season. And you guys will see a trend with this one. They're gonna be colorful and they're all kind of the scrunchy material. So the first one I got is this right here. It is a green little bathing suit. It's not full on like Brazilian bikini, but it also just shows a little bit of like cheeky cheekiness. And then here's the top right here. So it just has like the cutout in the center. That was bikini number one. I've actually already worn this right here. I love it. Hot neon pink right here. Same kind of style on the bottoms, I think. These ones actually might be slightly cheekier. Same top on the pink one right here. Love it. I've been really into pink lately. And then on this last bikini that I ended up getting, I got the orange color right here. Same bottoms on these ones with the ties but the top, I got the traditional triangle top, which are really fun because you can tie them all sorts of ways. Like, you know, have you seen the videos where they tie the bikini tops like 10 different ways? I don't know why, I just really like the texture of these ones. So, very cute, very excited about all of the bikinis. So I always order these little packs of, they're kind of like sports bra yoga tops, so they're like a bit of a compression top you can wear them as a sports bra i just like to wear them in the summertime as a tank top though and i've ordered so many packs of these from shein and i love them every time they come in like three packs and they have different colors and different styles but they're essentially kind of all the same has the v-neck in the front there also came in white and orange <laughs> been loving the orange Super cute, but they had a bunch of different colors of the different packs of these. So yeah, I really enjoy these. I have recently joined a little gym in my housing community and I've been trying to go and I need more tops. So this is a four pack of little sports bra tank tops. And I got these kind of like fun muted colors, but again, they have like 10 different options of the colors that you can do for these. So I got this one, just kind of like a slate gray blue kind of color very cute and then it came with this beautiful like eggplant maroony purple right there kind of like a light purpley grayish purple right here and then the traditional black right there I think that's everything that I got from this Shein haul. Let me know if you guys want me to do more Shein hauls in the future if you guys like to see these if you don't I know on my channel here I have a mixed community. Some people are here for only the thrifting. Some people are here for the sustainable living type of thing. So they don't really like love Shein. Some people are here for the affordability of clothing and fashion. So if this isn't your video, I understand. Just don't watch it. <laughs>
And if it is your video and you're into Shein and like cute, affordable accessories for summertime, let me know if you want me to do more of these. Let me know down below some of your favorite trends this summer for fashion. I've definitely just been into like all of the colorful pops of color in bag shoes, obviously, sunglasses. And then I've also been really into like the cargo-y like skater boy vibes on girls yeah i don't know if you guys have seen that tiktok but it's like the girl where she's like you move to california and then you start dressing like a little skater boy and kind of like what's wrong with that you know <laughs> definitely into that all right you guys love you so much and i hope you guys are doing well and i'll see you guys very soon in my next video bye bye bye